Friends, if you're like us, you might procrastinate, or maybe you just need a last-minute gift for someone. We're at the Dollar Tree. We're going to give you some gift ideas from the Dollar Tree on a budget. So we're going to do a spa-themed basket. I think this will be easy for everyone to get at the Dollar Tree. They have a kind of a lot of spa themed items. Also, if you know anybody who just had a baby, I did notice uh, my Dollar Tree. This Dollar Tree doesn't have a lot of the stuff that other Dollar Trees have, but they do have tons of baby stuff. So if you need some baby stuff or want to make a baby basket, this would be the place to do it. But let's do our spa themed basket. The first item that I want to look for is some slippers. These are awfully nice slippers to be a dollar. Dollar General sells these for five dollars. Just make sure you're getting the right size. And I would also get a lint roller and roll that lint off there. And also maybe a pair of fuzzy socks. Although we do want to try to do matchy matchy. Not always possible. But these are very nice fuzzy socks. Let's see what else we can find. It's very slim pickings for baskets. So we might have to settle for some kind of gift bag, although this is very not my style. We have uh, loofahs. Are these called loofahs, you guys? Please confirm to me that this is called a loofah. Let's read the tag. Bath puff. You look how dirty that is. Ugh. I would love to put name brand stuff in here. Here's a Aveeno face mask. So I'm going to pick one of these up. I believe Allure is also kind of a popular brand. Some Vaseline. got to say, if somebody was going to get me a basket, I would want it to be a spa-themed basket. Here's the same little basket here. My Dollar Tree is a out of a lot of the baskets. And even like, usually they have organizing things. They're out of everything. So we're going to use the same little basket here now i was really really impressed that dollar tree had john frida products these are expensive so we're going to put these in the basket there's two different ones so we're going to put both of those in our little basket here we have an eye mask the only thing i don't like about our basket this one it doesn't really match but that we only have so much we can work with a vino at the Dollar Tree, that's amazing. So we're gonna pick this up, put it in the basket. There's another face mask. This one is a pink foil pill-off mask. So I'm gonna put that one in there. Allure, I believe is a really good brand. I've heard things about it. Pore Clarifying Hazel Witch Facial Cleansing Wipes. So we're gonna get those. Who can live without fuzzy socks? Not me. We have a little blackhead remover situation. Every lady needs some chapstick. And then we also have a little mitt here for exfoliating. So we'll put that in our basket as well. I'm gonna put it towards the back. And so here is our little basket. You could always get some like wrap to put it in. $10 for everything in the basket, including the basket. This is a $11 spa themed name brand spa basket that you could give as a gift. I personally, like I said, would love to receive this gift. How cute were those baskets Krista made? My name's Christy, AKA management team from thepennyless.com. So I'm gonna show you two more baskets that you can do, put together affordable. Everything that I use for them is from the Dollar Tree. So the first one we're gonna do is a dog lover's basket. We got a blue basket from Dollar Tree. Not real big, because I'm gonna fit in a basket bag. The first thing I'm gonna do though, while we're doing this, is line this with tissue paper. Because we're gonna take it like a step further. Krista did it in store, I'm doing it at home. So we're gonna go ahead and decorate this, stick it in the bag, and show you like a pleated basket. So lined it with tissue paper. Then I'm gonna take some balled up tissue paper, oops, put that in the bottom, just some white tissue paper just to make the um, items stand up a little bit better. This is what we got here. Okay, first thing we got was a dog mat, so I'm just gonna put that like in the back of the basket, okay? Then I got this cute little canister, if you can see it, doggy bones on it. I wanted these bones to show up more, so I'm going to take the same color tissue paper and put it inside. And then just take some dog bones. Okay, so that's what we got right now. And I'm just going to sit these right in the top. 
to put in our basket. So I think that will look cute. Okay, and I'm just going to put the lid behind it. So here's what we got so far. And they had these adorable little love is a four-legged word. They had them in towels, pot holders, and, and oven mitts. We fell. We have a bloopers reel. We really do because we have a lot of bloopers. I'm just going to put this in this this way. That's what we got. I'm doing this really quick. Of course, you guys will take more time to try to arrange it nice at home. Actually, it has two of these. That's kind of cool. I'm going to put them. I'm actually going to roll these and just kind of put them up front here. And another towel. You'll know, arrange these better like at your house. And... You know, take some time to do it a little more neatly. Got a dog toy and a dog ball. I was looking for a dog-themed notebook at Dollar Tree. I couldn't find one. So, because, you know, everything in here is like, you know, brown, tan, went ahead and just got a uh, 2021 monthly planner calendar. Stick that in the top and then some pens. This is kind of what we're left with. And you can see that. Pretty cute. And I think I counted. This was only like 12, 12 or 13 dollars. I think it wasn't much. It's was pretty cheap. So that's the dog lovers basket from Dollar Tree. It's gonna be kitchen themed. I was looking for some kind of container to put the items in, but this colander was broken. So we're gonna go with like a red kitchen theme. I'm gonna pick up two of these dish towels. As you can see, they match their red. They have wine on them. I'm also gonna get the matching oven mitt. They have plenty of red utensils. So for our basket, I'm gonna pick up a couple of different ones of these. People seem to be into these dish drying mats so I'm going to add one of those to the basket some scissors everybody needs kitchen scissors I like this basket better it's not broken okay, this is our first basket we have a little basket of course everyone can use one of those dish drying mat scissors some kitchen utensils two hand towels and an oven mitt that all match this would be great for somebody who's maybe redecorating their kitchen going with like a red theme wine type theme but i think this is a great gift idea and you could really arrange it in this basket to look really really nice I know the background isn't that great. We're at the Dollar Tree. You could totally add in some of these uh, measuring cups as well. They match perfectly. My Dollar Tree is really empty. We're gonna do a coffee lovers basket. The stuff that I got, they have these little cute one dollar coffee mate creamers. They have the liquid ones in different flavors. So I got three of those. I got some Godiva chocolate bars, mug, some Hershey Kisses. These are so cool. I was so excited when I found these. I've not seen them in years past. But how cool are they? Candy cane spoons. In fact, I found them. I went ahead. We got some hot chocolate because I think this would be awesome together. And this cute little notebook. All you need is love and coffee. Same thing. Start with this. I actually thought this isn't Christmassy, but I thought it was really pretty. I actually got like this. I don't know if you can see it in there. I'm going to use tan just because of the color theme I was going with. And we'll make it look Christmassy when we put it in a basket. Tissue paper. Stuff the bottom again. The big items in the back, of course. If you had like a small party bag, you could take these out. Put them in a small party bag. Like the little clear um, like treat bags that little kids use for birthday parties. Put them in there and then tie each one with a little ribbon. And that would be really cute. Mug I'm actually going to take out of the box. Take it out of the box. I'm just arranging all these in here. Kind of where we're at with this. It's got all that good stuff in there. Um, I think it makes a cute little basket. Show you really quickly how to dress these up. Put them in a bag. Throw some ribbon on them. And really, um, I can't see them up. And... Just kind of polish them off. So we'll do that next. Is how to finish off your baskets, how to decorate them, how to make them look like put together, finish look. Okay, this was our coffee basket. The dog basket I've already put together. We're going to do this one. Basically, you're just going to get these bags from Dollar Tree. They come two in a bag. They are um, basket bags. They didn't have any curling ribbon. So had to improvise. Got some bows. 
and I'm just gonna literally pull them apart and now we have curling ribbon in the dog basket and I'll show you in a minute I did show you how to do these which it's no big deal these you can get at um, Dollar Tree for a dollar they take two double A batteries they don't come with it and they you just turn them on they have a little switch and I put the box in the back of the basket where I can reach it to um, turn it off and on. It's a good idea if you want to light your basket up. I'll show you what that looks like when we're done doing this one. It's really basic. Um, you're just going to put your basket in the bag like this. Make sure your tissue paper is like down so you can see what you got going on. If you want to put like holiday holiday themed paper in there to make it look better you can do that it's up to you at this point anyway it's really up to you how you want to do it i want it to do in this coffee basket will show you how you can use things that we've gotten for pennies um things that we've gotten coupon in like our blankets that we got yesterday we got these we got these for five dollars yesterday these blankets if you got them it was an amazing deal if you don't know how to do that Make sure you subscribe and follow Christy Coupon so you can learn. But this would be really awesome if you wanted to put in with this, um, in this coffee basket. So I'm going to put it in there. This is going to go to a friend of mine and I want it to kind of just upscale my basket a little bit. Everything in both the baskets that we did, the coffee and the dog baskets cost $11 I think for both. Really just pull this up. And take one of our curly ribbons, tie it off, tying it so that the ribbon ends up in the front. Like a lot of ribbons, I'm actually gonna throw some red in there. So bought the red bows and took them apart too. And some green. And how cute is that? I do with this all this stuff at the top. Sometimes it'll be really long. Just pull it off, pull it up. And just like you're doing a haircut and cut it just like that. Spread that out. So that would make a cute little basket for somebody. And you could also, if you wanted to, add a Starbucks card. The dog lover's basket, you could add a pet smart card, and that would be a really cool gift if you wanted to upscale it, but it actually would be fine just the way we did it. Eleven bucks. These are also really good resale things. You could also add um, some of the things we've gotten recently for a penny or a couponing. In the dogs one, we've got we got those harnesses for a penny. We got the um, Anna Life. We've couponed them and gotten them free all year. I think feels like it. It'll be cute. If you don't know how to penny shop or coupon, you need to subscribe to Kirsty Coupons, and we'll teach you how to do that. Hopefully, this helped. I hope y'all have a great Christmas. It's been a fun year. Look forward to next year with y'all too. So, thank you. Have a great day. Almost forgot. I need to show you the finished product with the lit up dog basket. So the little lights are coming out, so pretend that's not like that. But yeah, it looks cute if you just kind of lay them in there. And then the little box that turns it off and on is right there, so I can easily just flip it off and on, so I get to give it to the person, okay? This is the finished product for the Dog Lovers Basket. I don't know who to give credit to, but somewhere recently i seen somebody have thrown together a little emergency kit. They have rolls of toilet paper up here, uh, the tissue, paper towels, napkins, paper plates. You could always do like an emergency kit, especially with what's going on in the world, especially if you live in like a snowy area. They also have the four packs of toilet paper too, which I've heard actually decent things about this for a dollar. Thanks to Christy for participating in this video. I'm gonna put a video that you guys need to watch up here in the corner it'll be a little eye and we'll see you in the next one be sure to subscribe bye